Yeah, the other thing that annoys me... You might know him as the Labiz guy. His video went viral on the internet, more than a million views for mocking the French way of saying hello. Before moving to Paris, my face had never touched another man's face. So imagine my reaction when my friend Robert tried to say hello to me one day. Hey, Paul, on fait the bise, hein? Give me a kiss. Get out of here. In less than a month, Paul Taylor's career as a stand-up comedian has taken off. And because practice makes perfect, he often rehearses with his two cats at home. You know there's 15 days in two weeks here. Did you know that, Willie? 15 days, whereas seven times two is 14. A joke greeted with a cuddle. But you don't care, do you? It's not funny for you. Paul used to work for the IT giant Apple. Three years ago, he quit his job to follow his dream and create his own show, Franglais. This is my list of jokes in yellow, and then the language that I do them in pink. So, for example, this joke here, le footing. Le fo the footing isn't an English word. Mais c'est parce qu'en France, on a déjà utilisé le mot le jogging pour le pantalon que tu mets pendant que tu fais du footing. An hour before the curtain raises, Paul feels nervous, but always keeps his sense of humour. Il manque qu'une pince, c'est tout. C'est tout ce qui manque. Pour être bien British. Pour être bien British et sortir assez relax, voilà. At 29, Paul has climbed the comedy ladder, despite having never attended a theatre class. J'aurais jamais pensé que dans ma vie j'aurais une loge avec des lumières comme ça. Ça fait très, ça fait très star. Et mais c'est cool, c'est cool. Je suis content de de ce que je suis en train de faire et puis bah, on verra si, si ça plaît au monde. Bonsoir Paris, est-ce que ça va bien ce soir Yes, welcome to the show. Franglais pinpoints cultural differences and language barriers between both sides of the channel. From grammatical mistakes to bad translation, Paul Taylor has certainly fulfilled his dream to make people laugh. My girlfriend, she's French, she has the same problem with the H and it makes it very difficult for me to know if she's angry or hungry. She's like, Paul, I am so hungry. Uh, so the only way I figured out to solve this problem is to make her dinner and apologize at the same time. <laughs> that way, everything's good.